What's up everybody, Scrapehog.com here. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to get auto-approved lists using Scrapebox. Now the first few steps I skip because these are things that really any basic Scrapebox user should know how to do, but I will briefly go over them. Of course, select your platforms. I suggest just selecting all the blog platforms. Then you got your keywords. Of course, you can have a few core keywords, base keywords, and then use the keyword scraper. And actually, it is the 19th today. Scrapebox just added in eBay suggestions as a new keyword scraper. So that's kind of cool. Uh, of course, use proxies. Scrape from Google, Yahoo, and Bing. After you do all that, you will end up with your harvested URL list. Take that list and transfer it over to the blogs list for commenter. Of course, put in your names put in your emails and actually for the names and emails I use the name and email generator generate names and then put numbers we'll just say hotmail.com generate emails save those lists load them in for the site used as your backlink do not put your actual site in uh, this is just for checking for auto approve so I just put blah.com comments again just they can be really generic you can really only use a couple if you want uh, these are not pointing to your site so it does not matter so start the fast poster this is going to attempt to go on the blogs and we'll see if it can post to them uh, auto approve means that as soon as you submit your comment your comment shows up so your backlink is there instantly the blogs are not moderated, they do not have capture protection, they are just completely open. Now I am going to stop this early. I know this list is a bit small, but I just had a small list for time's sake, so you don't have to watch a lot of links get posted and sifted through. So after you do that, you would export the list. You could export successfully posted using the export posted entries but I would recommend not doing that because sometimes Scrapebox says it'll fail posting to a site when it actually succeeded so I would just say check your entire list so now you want to go over to check links and you would check these links I have already done that so it found 18 links found I would export that export the links found I'm just going to name it links found Save that. Go back up to your harvester. Clear it. Import that links found list. Trim to root. Remove duplicate URLs. Now, in the harvester, you're going to want to select custom footprint and use the site operator. For your keywords, I guess export this. I'm just going to name it trim check. You're going to import the file that you just saved for your keywords with those uh, root URLs. And like I said, use the custom footprint and site operator. What the site operator is going to do is going to check Google, Yahoo, and Bing for all index pages on these sites that we successfully posted to. And if one page, one article on a site has auto approved comments, then it's really likely that more of their pages are going to have comments. So, this is just going to expand our auto approved list off just these base sites that we got. Of course, use proxies and start harvesting. Uh, I'm not going to use proxies right now or Yahoo and Bing. I would suggest doing it just because this list isn't that big, so I don't really see a need to. So it's going to go and find all of these indexed URLs. And I'm going to stop this early, just so you guys don't have to be bored by this. So there we go. Found all of these URLs. Remove duplicate URLs. No duplicates found. Take the list. Again, transfer URLs to blog list for commenter. Now you're going to start posting on the list again same info and everything so we'll see how many successes are with the expanded list 
and again I'm going to stop this early of course let your list run all the way through and I would still advise checking your entire list not just your successes up and abort and again check links I know this is repetitive but this is just so that you can grow your auto approve list check your links I'm going to stop it here of course let your list run all the way through export the links found I'm going to put it as AA list because this is now our official auto approve list we know that we can comment blast on these websites and if you want to take it a step further which is what I usually do is I go to the outbound link checker and what this is going to do is it's going to check for how many internal and external links there are on all these pages so load your file your AA list start I usually don't keep URLs with more than 50 external links on any given page just because it's really not a good look in Google's eyes and I know comment blasting isn't for your money site but if you're doing tiered linking it still matters and it takes forever to load if there's a site that's been spammed to hell like this there's 2,000 external links on this site another 2,000 on that so these have been completely spammed to hell these are not URLs that you want to post on so now I would filter entries with more than XXX external links and of course I said 50 and then this would be my auto approve list I would save to scrape box and then I would export this list and this would be my official AA list so there you go that is how you make your own auto approve list I don't really get why people buy auto approve lists considering well especially if you have Scrapebox you can just do it yourself of course you're gonna wanna harvest more URLs use more keywords and yeah you can head on over to scrapehog.com to get more Scrapebox resources GSA resources uh, we just started up an email list you can sign up just put your email in sign up and we send out weekly auto approved Scrapebox lists and weekly GSA lists to expand the sites that you can post on and that is pretty much it guys. Thanks for watching.